All right, buddy. Tell him bye. Say you'll see him in a couple of days. Tell him you'll see him in a couple of days. He said he'll see you guys in a couple of days, which I'm sure you're aware. By the title of this video, but me and Tracy are going Pigeon Forge. That's where we are at. We just got to the room, getting ready to go eat. Let's go have an awesome day. We're gonna go to this place called the Smoky Mountain Deli. No, it's not called It's called the Pigeon Forge Deli? Yes. I knew it was something like that. It's supposed to have really good food, so let's go and test it out. This has, what is it? Turkey, bacon, oh. ham, cheese, cheese some mine, other stuff. Tracy says lettuce and tomato, mine does not, but man, fantastic. Is done. What do you think about a tray? Good. How good? good. Scale of one to ten. I bet they couldn't hear you because the microphone on this isn't great. Um, it's supposed it's it's supposed to rain today, so I'm actually filming a lot on my phone because I don't want to bring my camera out because like you're not always indoors and I don't want to get my camera wet. So I don't know. Round two, just in case. How was dinner? That's I mean, good. how was lunch? It was good. Would you rate it? It's their top rated place down here. I liked it a lot. Tracy liked it a lot. Not sure if it would be the top rated place. It's definitely, it's definitely worth going back to. Yeah, yeah. It was very, very good, man. The tons, just portion size is gargantuan. Huge, yeah. That pretzel, I don't know if the video did it justice, but that pretzel had to have been the size of my face. So, and that's a fat, fat face. So, I don't know. I don't know what we're doing next. I guess we're going to go somewhere. We're going to an ATM next. Going to an ATM. Yeah, we got to get some cash out. But anyway, we're going to get to, I don't know, head somewhere and you guys will come along. We're going to do some things. Are you going to get the little passport too? I don't know. So last year, since Tracy was pregnant, we uh, didn't get to come and do this. Like, there's a thing that they do called the wine trail, right? Yeah. And you basically go to like four or five different wineries and you collect this passport and they give you like a free gift after it. And since after Tracy. After three and after five. Yeah, so since Tracy didn't get to do it last time, we're gonna do that now. And I'm gonna buy some wine. And Tracy's gonna this buy some This is my favorite wine. winery down here. Yeah, it is. Old Apple Barn Winery. Yeah. What's that? Yeah. That's so, so we got some wine. We bought some peach stuff. Yeah, there it is. <laughs> And it's weird because I actually enjoy, like, I'm not a wine fan. I'm not an alcohol fan in general. Let me actually start by saying uh, that. We're not crazy. It was cheaper to buy three. Yeah, it was so, cheaper to buy three than it was. I think it was like, like one. yeah, one was like 20. 18. 18 and three was. 13 a piece. 13 a piece. So way cheaper. But anyway, um, anyway, so uh, yeah, I, I'm not a big alcohol fan, but like that stuff was good. It was a very sweet wine. It wasn't super dry or anything. So it was super so solid. Good. I didn't really film a whole lot of the wine tasting thing because we're gonna be doing a lot of that. I'm gonna try to showcase There's a little bit more six places. of the area. Go this way. But we're gonna go check out the actual vineyards now. Are and, we? Yeah, that's like, what those are. That's like where they grow oh, the grapes and stuff. I didn't know that's where you're going. Yeah. Where else were we going? I thought you were going to the little store over there. No. Oh, well, we can do that too. We're gonna go in the store too. The vineyard was way smaller than what I remembered it was, so and we didn't go to that store either. So we're just gonna go ahead and head on to the next thing. Mountain Valley Winery. Mountain Valley Winery. God, it is hot outside. It and is. then we're gonna do some other stuff as well. I don't think we're doing 
it is just five wineries, but they count the Moonshine Place. Oh, okay, gotcha, I gotcha. I don't think we're going to all of the wineries today, just a couple. And then we're going to do a couple of other things. So, but and then if some we dinner. don't go all today, we'll finish tomorrow. Finish tomorrow, yeah, yeah. So, probably, probably actually spread them out for the vlog so you guys don't get bored with the wine stuff. So, here's a handy map. Good. Oh, yeah. So second place, we actually like the wine there better, yeah. but we've already bought some wine at the Apple Barn. I'm not um, saying we won't buy any more, yeah, but we, we need to go anymore. to the other places and We need to check them out. So that they place had really good rhubarb wine. Yeah. And what was the other one that I liked? The grape one? The no, red? It was, yeah, Red Valley something. Yeah. It, it tasted really good. like grape juice. Yeah. Very, very good. Um, that is Mountain Valley Winery in Pigeon Forge. Um, the first one we were at was Apple Barn. We can't, um, we can't go to... Sugarland or the Moonshine Place, they're both in Gatlinburg. They're both in Gatlinburg? Mm -hmm. We can hit those tomorrow. Okay. So today we could hit... So we've already got two. Yeah, if we get one more today, we get a glass. Okay. We can go to Millbridge, Hillside. That's it. And then that'll leave us two more. All right. On to the next one. pretty cool it's a forgery back there and you can like pay and take uh, like you can pay and learn how to make stuff that's pretty cool all right we're gonna take a break from wineries for a second we're gonna visit the cat house we came down here for the first time last time we were down here we had never been here before and uh, we really enjoyed it so let's go check this place out Cat house was cool, but now we are gonna go to the winery. It looks almost the exact same as it did last time. That's why we didn't stay very long. So, and I filmed a lot of that last year. But anyway, let's go to this winery. This is South. This is Mad. This is just called South. South. Yeah. This is Mad Muscadine. Mad Muscadine. And this is OCC. OCC. Yeah, you know me. You know me. Granny Smith apples is this one. I thought it was this one. This is just apple cider, dry apple cider. Yeah, apple cider. Good. Yeah, you probably wouldn't like it. You wanna try it? I can try it. This is Sunny Sweet. It's Granny Smith apples. Granny Smith apples. So it's probably salad. Yeah. This is better than the first one, but it's very similar. It tastes more almost like carbonated water, like it's really carbonated to me. This is Mad Muscadine, Muscadine, however you say it, and it's a southern sweet, traditional crisp apple finish. It's a delightful crisp apple finish. Delightful. That one's a lot sweeter. I like that one. A lot sweeter. It's not bad. I still don't like it that much, but it's not bad. What's next? OCC. It's orange, cranberry, and cinnamon. Orange, with apple. cranberry, and cinnamon. Hence the name. Got it. You can definitely taste the cinnamon. Really? It reminds me of like warm apple cider that you drink at Christmas. Nice. Mm. 
Yeah, it's cinnamon all over. Did you not like it? <laughs> it was okay. It was okay. Stamps, our three stamps. All right, yeah, we've got four. Three. Three of the six stamps. Yeah, it got us free wine glasses, which we'll show you when we get in the car. We're and we've got, in. we've got two more in Gatlinburg tomorrow, and then one more on the way out. So, also, I don't know if you can see me at all. It looks like the sun is glaring. Let me talk to you when we get to the car. All right, we're going to do Wonderworks. I've never done this before. Tracy has. Are you ready? It's been 11 years. It's been a long time, so this should be fun. Well, it's been never for me. That is so trippy. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna test how long I can keep my hand in water that killed people on the Titanic. I mean, it's not the exact one. Oh my God. Oh, I can't do that. Six seconds. Six seconds. Oh my God. Let's start. Go. Is that not freezing? Oh, you beat me, but that's terrible, isn't it? I think it's ten. Pull it a little faster, it seems. Popped again. Wonderworks is done. It's like 7.30. I thought it was fun. That's Tracy's second time doing it. That's my first time going in there. Hopefully the footage turned out good. They always keep these places kind of more so dark, I guess, to prevent people from like taking pictures and stuff like that. I don't know. Ho hopefully the footage turns out okay. But uh, it was pretty cool. Laid on a bed of nails. That was pretty sweet. Did some other cool things. Yeah. I think now we are going to go eat, perhaps. Still have to decide that. Trey, what do you want? You don't know. 
to the everyday struggle, man. We're gonna spend about four or five hours figuring out what Tracy wants to eat, and I'll holler at you guys here in a bit. Isn't he's ominous? Yep, super ominous. So we decided we're not gonna do anything huge because we're not overly hungry, and we've never tried this place. It is Zaxby's. We're gonna give it a shot. Who knows? Uh, hopefully it's gonna be good. Hopefully it's not overly expensive either. We thought about that after we got out of the car. Maybe it's gonna be expensive. Hopefully not. So let's go check this food out. Not bad. It was super cheap too. It was only like twelve dollars. Twelve. Twelve dollars. You can even have that celery. Have it for free. So yeah, pretty anxious about this. Let's see how it tastes. Dinner success. What'd you think, Trey? Scale of one to ten. A seven, but not because I didn't like the chicken. I didn't like the toast so much it was on. It would have been better on like a bun. Yeah, solid though, right? It was good. What yeah. about a scale of one to Chick Fil A? Um, I still like Chick Fil A better. I do too. But Definitely solid though. Definitely, Zaxby's. You're doing some good stuff. All right, so hotels have super crappy lighting, and I forgot uh, to show you guys these cups. I noticed it when I was editing. Here are the wine glasses we got for going to the three consecutive shops and I think after you go to the fifth shop they give you something too. But here's the wine glass that we got for going to that trail. Rocky Top Wine Trail. That's pretty cool man. Pretty cool wine glass. That's what both of them say. Let me actually roll this back up. But yeah, I just wanted to show you guys that because I totally forgot to, you know, when I said I was going to. All right, guys, and I'm going to end the vlog there. Fantastic day, such a great day. What an awesome day. I don't know how much else I can say. Did that rhyme? I guess it did. Tracy is in bed. I am finishing editing the video that you are watching right at this very second. And then I'm going to go to bed so we can get up and do it again tomorrow. I hope you guys enjoyed it today. I feel like I've definitely improved over vlogging from my last Pigeon Forge series last year. But also I was 17 days in versus 317 days in. So I definitely have made some strides. Hopefully. Hope you guys enjoyed it. So thank you guys so much for watching. Thanks for coming along on the journey. And I'll see you guys tomorrow.